you wonder how you can create shapes from MicroStation using ChatGPT or AI. Now look at these few steps. Create your own VBA code. In this case I have this one. And this give me like this. And then I have my guidance. So this open these instructions. So I will copy them and go to my website. Then I'll put instruction here. So I'll change this one to let's say three bed house and then just put out there. Then you have these instructions. So I'm gonna copy them like so. Then go to my um, file I will press this one then I have to do some few changes so I will do that so now we're done then I will save that file now coming back now to MicroStation now um, I can say import shape and we have our plan so you can see that's the bathroom that's the hallway that's the bedroom that's bedroom 2 bedroom 3 living room and kitchen it's very simple uh, let me try another one we create a new one so I'm gonna again open the open the guidance so I'm gonna copy them this time I want to do a railway station so let's see if we can get that one so again I will do the same thing in this case I will keep railway station this is only example and I will see what I get Give it a few seconds. Okay, so I have what is seem like a railway station. So let me copy that as well. So let's see what uh, AI has for us. Save the file and let's see now what we have. So I will click the shape, then create new one. Good. So what do you have here? We have platform one, platform two, footbridge, waiting area, and ticket office. So this is very, I mean, scratching the surface of what AI can do. Um, but yeah, if you can give good prompts to AI, you can do plenty more than this. Yeah, I hope this explains how you can use AI with MicroStation.